In this nightmare, I'm back in the autopsy suite, and her teeth unstick from her lips, and she gurgles at me. Please help me. There's somebody out there on the ground and a police officer. Oh my God. Okay, sir, tell me exactly what happened. My name is Karen Smith. For 11 years, I was a forensic detective in Jacksonville, Florida. But right now, I'm just someone with stories to tell. Stories of victims you've likely never heard of, and the emotional toll that working around death and destruction has on the people tasked with finding the answers to what happened to them. There are things about it that are deeply rooted. There's just too much blood for that. And sometimes, you just can't get over it. I was scared to death. They stabbed my partner. They stabbed me too. We had a really worst case scenario. None of it made any sense. And when we rolled her body over, <sighs> when you see something like that, you get angry or you just shut it down. Detectives taped a wire to Jimmy Jackson's chest. How did you do it? That is the voice of a terrified man. I told you I'd do what I had what? to do. We had an unidentified victim, who done it murder. And that's a little bit unusual. It was a really forceful crash. This truck looked like it could have been a crack rental. We have a dead, retired cop. Whoever did it was savvy enough to pick the casings up and take them with him. And she put her finger in my chest and she said, you find out who did this. Follow along each week as I dig into my journals and relive the emotions, the pain, and the triumph of these hard-won victories for the victims and the shattered souls of their loved ones left behind. Subscribe to CrimeCon Presents Shattered Souls, a Forensic Detective's Diary on your favorite podcast platform. Available on May 9th.